Hi guys, Sam here from Super Nerd Gaming and I'm back for another vid. Now, this is going to be entitled Gaming Memories, this vid. So this is going to kick off where gaming all started for me. Now, where gaming all started for me was back in 1990 when I first got the Sega Mega Drive. So, I love myself there a bit. <laughs> Not this version, but the Mark 1. It is still going, my Sega Mega Drive that I've got. It is just over here. And I'll put a picture on screen. But yeah, it's amazing. I mean, going from a kid that's never played a computer before to getting a Sega Mega Drive, you know, the blast processing, it was amazing. Um, I didn't have many games when I was a kid, though. We only really got games around, say, Christmas or birthdays. More Christmas, not around birthdays much. Um, so I had a very limited range for my Sega Mega Drive, but we did get Sonic to kick it off with. It was boxed in Sonic, um, and that's probably where my love for Sonic started. I mean, if it, maybe if I got a Nintendo and I started off with Mario, I might still be like that now, but anything Sonic, I'm mad for. But we had a few games. We had, you know, when we started getting into it, we had Sonic, we had... Uh, Jungle Strike, uh, we lent Desert Strike, we didn't own it, but I do now, as you can see over here. Um, the Game Boys are in the way at the minute, that's prepping for another video of uh, gaming memories. But um, yeah, the, the Sega Mega Drive just blew me away as a kid, it was amazing. It still amazes me today. I think the reason I collect more for the Sega Mega Drive now is because it was my first console. I didn't have many games, so I'm kind of making up for that now. I, I think it's a terrific console now. I mean, I was always a Sega fanboy because of that from the beginning. I'm not so much now because I collect as you can see, there's a load of NES games over there. I collect for everything now. Well, there's some stuff I won't collect for, but that's like, I find it too basic without being offensive to those games. So like the Atari, I find that very basic. Um, and I, I don't want to be offending people by that, but I grew up in the 16-bit era, even though I go back to the 8-bit with the Master System and NES because I think they're both two great consoles as well especially the Master System, the Master System is just heavily underrated everyone talks about the NES so much but the Master System looked great the rectangular kind of Master System looking thing as it is um, I did have the uh, Mark II originally where I bought it off my mate years and years after the system died and I loved it uh, but you know recently I got a boxed uh, Master System 1, I say recently, it was last year and an Expo I got it which was quite good. But anyway guys, that's my gaming memories is getting the Mega Drive, that was my first gaming console. I want to know what yours is, you know, leave a comment in the comment box below and as always thank you for watching, I really appreciate it. Appreci uh, I really appreciate it um, and if you like the video give us a thumbs up and share it out. Catch you later guys.